The main obstacle is misunderstandings. Paco said that, in fact. Because in the learning process, if there is this misunderstanding, that will block you like anything. It will, you will get stuck in rhythm, in technique, or in repertory. Easily get stuck there because of misconception. For example, people may think that if I go like this with the foot, I, I am learning rhythm. That's why I, I do that. Because in flamenco dance, they do footwork, the dances. No, that's not true. We need to, to count the stuff, right? If we play with a metronome and have the first of all the habit of using metronome to practice, right? Two, three, four. One, two. If I do that, if I can count and play simultaneously with the metronome, then I really got the rhythm thing. The foot is not going to do anything. This Paco said that actually. We have to, we have to have matching uh, an objective parameter of, of exactness, metronome, and make friendship with this, and then we match our own counting out loud with this and with what we play and this is called beyond objection thing rhythm beyond objection or perfection as we like to call it because this thing doesn't lie this, this is a, a, a clock so therefore but misconception is there or because we don't get the information properly or because we follow too many uh, guys that one said one thing, they'll say another, they'll say another, they'll say another, and then therefore you never got it right because you are just doubting. Doubts there, of course, part of these misconceptions are because of doubts that we don't clear. This is because either the, well, there is there is several kinds of, of stones and, and of people around the many hundreds of stones I, I told them these years, I can say it because I have this personal experience with them. And well there is people who, who who are very enthusiastic and they don't know and they want to know. Right? Then there are others who think they know and they don't know. And they don't want to know actually. And then there are others who don't know but would but pretend that they know and they they, they inside they wish that they they will come to know it. But for several reasons, one way or the other, it may happen that you don't get the right information and or that you don't apply it right. Because there is also science how you practice. That's why I said do it yourself and be confused forever in this flamenco thing. Because here it's not like blues or in rock, in other styles maybe you can learn it alone. But Satriani or Ali Meola or anyone has one DVD thing that exists still the DVD. Before there were this beta, the uh, BHD also, you know, videos, but uh, tape videos. But I'm talking about the 80s and, and the 90s, and, and every artist made a DVD of, of kind of tutorial thing or teaching something. Paco never did it. Why? Do you think they, he didn't got the offer from recording music at that time, remember? Big offer. For this thing, paying a lot of money for doing it, but he said, "No, I don't do this because I don't. I don't believe that someone can learn this like that." Me ayudó porque descubrí ahí el, la improvisación. La improvisación es algo que yo pienso que cada músico debería, cada músico del estilo que sea, del clásico, del flamenco, de cualquier otra música debería debería aprender porque en la improvisación te da mucha libertad y a la vez te da mucho conocimiento de, de dónde estás tocando y cómo estás tocando y qué armonías están en cada momento ¿no? Muy bien. Pablo sí, Paco, ¿qué es para usted la música popular y qué es la música elitista? Yo creo que la música elitista es el refinamiento de la música popular por ejemplo el flamenco el flamenco originalmente es una música popular la música del pueblo andalucía pero creo que ya no le pertenece más al pueblo, porque de pronto 
Habemos gente que nos hemos pasado toda una vida encerrados, puliendo esa expresión popular. Entonces ha llegado a un nivel en el que, en el, que el pueblo ya no, no, no tiene acceso, sobre todo a los matices que vamos consiguiendo la gente como yo, que nos pasamos muchas horas elaborando esa música.